Okay, Shalom, Shalom, Kwam Yashala. Kol Holo Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakach Dash. That were honors to our apostles and elders, a great millstone who rule well. That by the Spirit taught us this beautiful truth and just want to say, the waters while you Aki Menachwaf, that's out here sincerely keeping the law, statutes, and commandments of Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakach Dash to the best of your ability. And just wanted to just do a quick video. I mean, hey, I, I, I got up this morning, and you know, I kind of prayed for this yesterday, man, for just tokens, you know what I'm saying, from Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Not that we need to see them, but you know, it builds the faith, it builds the spirit. And um, now this right here, it, I mean, just funny, just funny examples, man, or, you know, we rarely get to laugh, and it's true. And today, I got, I began the day off laughing at a video that the brothers put up with this one Edomite ranting. And here you go with another Edomite, he's ranting. But now this will show you the difference between Esau and Jake. Now, had this been a Jake, yeah, I think it would have turned out a little bit different. But anyway, I think it's, it's, it's funny. It's comedy. But this right here is Esau Edom's kingdom. And you can tell just by this. This is a perfect example of this is their kingdom. And this never would have happened if it was a so-called black person or a so-called Hispanic or so-called Native American. They would have fucking flipped this guy over. <laughs> bang this put his damn head through the wall and all kinds of stuff but anyway let's get some of the video here we go they said there was a 911 from whose cell phone what cell phone number do y'all have it on record or file or anything 732 940 Nine four zero seven six seven nine. Not my number. Whose number is that? Is it mine? Seven three two four zero. Mine is eight four eight one six six. No one's phone number here. All right, let's get this sorted out then, so we don't have to come back. All right. What do you want to sort out? What have we not sorted out? We sort. It's a landline. Okay. Okay. No, there's no landline here. But there's still one registered to this house. So what do you want me to do for you? So there, we solved with a 911. Okay, so get the fuck out now. Sir. No, no, sir. You just slammed the door at me. Get the fuck Now, <laughs> let me mention, though, because this may not be an Edom Edomite. I, I kind of seen his hand flash across the scene. So let me, you know, um, respectively, you know, correct myself. You know, because skin color is not what we're into when it comes to the Hebrew Israelites. They'll say black Hebrew Israelites. But we're not black. We're different shades of brown. But there are actually actually people that look like these police officers that are actually Israelites because we've been scattered throughout the four corners of the earth. That was one of the um, curses. And I mean, Israelites look like so-called Chinese people, so-called Japanese people, so-called. I mean, <laughs> you name it, because we've been scattered throughout the four corners of the earth. A lot of our people are in North Korea, South Korea, you know, from the Korean War. Um, World War II, our people were deployed in a lot of places, and a lot of places where the men went, Israelite men went, especially, you know, we just, hey, we impregnated women from other nations, and our children came out looking like the, the, the other nations, and they're actually Israelites. That's why sometimes you'll see, like, somebody that actually have, like, a, you know, you'll think it's a so-called white guy, and he got a lot of swag. That's because he's a, a, a Israelite, and a lot of our people don't know. Because even, you know, the average Jake don't know that they're Israelite. The average so-called black America, they don't know that they're Israelite. They just think that they're black or they just think that they're, that they're African-American. And that shit is just not true, man. So, so lucky for that, you know, because like I said again, but he's, <laughs> I guess I was just kind of listening to him and he sounds like an Edomite. But I mean, this is Edomite. Now, we do read the spirit. We go by the spirit as well because had this been... A so-called black, Hispanic, and Native American. I'm just thinking that it would have turned out differently. So let's just continue with the video. Get the fuck out of the house! You don't close the door on the police. I don't give a fuck. You have no right to enter. We do, actually. No, you don't. Do. It's a warrantless entrance, so get the fuck okay. out. Get out. What's your name? Get out. I'm not giving you nothing. Get out. We need your name. Yeah, you're not going to get it. Get out. Have I committed a crime? Am I suspected of committing a crime? Yes. I have a Fourth Amendment right, bro. Don't trample my rights. You're not going to get ID. Yes, you do have a right. Let's go. We need your name so you can We're not going to get it. You want us to record that we were out here? What happened? Not going to get it. Okay, so when they call 911 again, you want them to come knocking on your door again? 
I want to record that we came here, we spoke with you, we confirmed that everyone in the house... Not going to get it. Nobody's number. Not going to give it. That is no longer a Not going to give you my information because of what you did with the door. Take your pompous prick ass, both of you, get the fuck out of the house. That's it. You pissed me the fuck off when you tried trampling in here. You banging on the door like a bunch of fucking animals. Came in here oh, trying to I throw your I fucking have. fictitious authority around. Walking into my house without a fucking warrant. Get the fuck out, both of you. We need your name, sir. I'm not giving you nothing. Get out. Sir, this doesn't have to be a bigger issue than it is. I'm leaving, so. 241, can you provide an update? I'm not giving you nothing. We fared out to landline. Just an uncooperative home run. Get out. You don't want us to document what happened. Get out! Did no, I stutter, st stutter? Get the fuck out! Why? Is it's just you three folks in the residence? Yes. You're good, man? Yeah. Right. Everyone's good. Get out. Get out. Get out. We don't want to be an issue. Name and badge number. Name and badge number. The name and badge number. Name and badge number. Name and badge number. What? What do we got? Name and badge number. Let's close the door in case he's pissed off to push the door. Okay. And now he won't give us his name. Who else is upstairs? Girlfriend and roommate. Nobody here. It's a landline. Everything's good. We're just trying to get his info. I want you to go. I'm not going to give any of you my information. You're not scaring me. Oh, they're all saying that's just the freedom. And everyone's saying they're fine. The number does connect to a landline. They don't have a landline here. Okay. Did you, what did you do that? Like triple play thing and just not hook the phone? I'm not answering any questions. Please get out of my house. You understand why we're here, right? I don't care why you're here. Get the fuck out. Turn that off. So let Turn me, that light off. Let me explain this to you. Jesus Christ. There you go. You see. How many of you does it take to Sir. see? Where do you want to look at? Can I explain something to you? I don't want to hear you what have, you have to you say. You have people you care about. I don't right? care. Please exit my house. You have people you care Please about? Please exit my house. Sir. You're not one of them. Exit my house. Very well. Get so out of my house. You, no. No. So look at it. If you send them out, I'll speak to you. All Get right. them the fuck out of here. Get back out, let me talk. Get the fuck out of here, especially you. Have you. a nice night, sir. Fuck Please off. Let me talk. Fuck out of my house, bro. Have a blessed night, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go fucking. Uh, you just gotta go right there. I'll go talk. fuck your mother, you fuck. I appreciate it. Not you. That's fine. Fuck you. <laughs> That's fine. Fuck you. off. <laughs> Get out of my house. Sir, talk to me. Sir. All right. Get him the fuck That's out of my house. Right Step right there. That's fine. Right. Can they shut the door? Get him out of my house? Shut the door with me. Yeah. Well, okay. that, I got nothing to say to you. So, listen, I got nothing to say to you. This way, right? Just listen to me like this. Do you think you see what I'm saying? Sir. I have nothing to say to you. You have people you care about, right? Get them out of my house, sir. Sir, house. sir I'm trying to reach Shut my door. Explain. They can't shut the door with me. Well, then you can all go fuck yourselves. Sir, just all please. go fuck yourselves. I got nothing sir. to say. You're not going to get ID. Sir, I don't want to hear sir, an explanation or nothing. That's fine. I'm not going to touch you. I'm unarmed. Sir, it's, it's just I got no I have a I have a cell phone. Jesus Christ. If you're that afraid, you shouldn't sir. be police. Get the fuck out of my house. Sir. Sir, what? Let me talk to you, please. Then get them out of my house. They are all literally. Shut he has literally one foot in okay. my house. He'll take his foot out of the door. Get his foot out of the door. Okay. I'm gonna be that fucking petty. Get your fuck. Okay. He's still in there. Okay. Get him out. His foot and then we'll talk. Okay, okay. then get him to move his foot. Listen to me. Get him to move his foot. Okay. So Jesus, it's private fucking property, right? This is so how they act. When we get 911 calls, we have to go. Uh -huh. You have people you care about. If something bad happened to them and we responded, uh -huh. you would want us to do everything we can to make sure they're okay, right? You guys are thugs. I don't I, I, I don't think you would do anything. So if somebody did something here... I respect Edison. Injured, I don't respect North Brunswick. We have a duty to make sure no one is injured. That dude hit me with the fucking door. Look at that on my fucking arm. Sir? Hit me with the door. Is, your, is, is, is that on? Yes, it is. Hit me with the door. Sir. Look at it on your camera. Are you interested in your get, get, get them over here. No, I, I want you to get the fuck out of my house. I was having a great night watching the UFC fight, taking care of fucking Christmas gifts. You guys are banging here like a bunch of fucking animals. I don't want to hear what you have to say. I want you all to take your pompous fucking gang-related fucking activity asses and get the fuck off private fucking property. None of you live here. Nobody's talked about any of that, sir. I'm trying to... Uh, well, okay, well, now I'm talking about it. Please exit. What do you want from me? Skype Yeah. What do you guys want from me? This is my boss, sir. 
Keep, keep him away from me. I don't want you touching me, dude. You don't know what's going on, sir. Yeah, this is all. Awesome. Just sitting here, got a bang on the. I have an internal affairs complaint on one of the sergeants, and now this shit happens. This is retaliatory. This is another one going to internal affairs. I'm telling you, you guys don't know how to fucking quit. Any of you? Can I explain to you what's going on? I want you guys to leave. I don't care. They don't care. They don't care. No one cares. We want you out. Common sense, like we understand. Why? I don't understand. Like you, you guys can't take a fucking hint. You think you have a right to push my fucking door in? Your 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 cops push my door and hit me with the door right there. I'm not, I, I'm I'm unarmed. I have a fucking camera. Technically, what you did could have been obstruction. They're here on a lawful police investigation. Then take me for it. I, I want you to take me for it. I didn't observe it, but from what they're telling me. That's, I'm just telling you technically this, okay? Then let's go. I'll take it to court. I, 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 I'm, I'm not, you, none of you are going to fucking scare me and bully me. None of you. You guys try it all the fucking time. It's not going to work. You push me around too much, and now this is what you get. Shouldn't have fucking pushed, your, pushed my fucking buttons all those times. You want to be up my ass on Route 1 driving like a bunch of fucking assholes? This is the response you get. Push my fucking door in, this is the response you get. Hit me with my own door, this is the fucking response you get. Don't push my buttons, this is private property. Now I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of you motherfuckers out here. What do you have to say that's going to justify any of this? I want to hear it. We came out here to investigate a 911 hang-up. Okay, did anybody call? Have you, have you figured that out? No, we haven't. Uh, okay, so what do you have to figure out? <laughs> what do you have to figure out? If anybody was need, in need of assistance, man. No. Does anybody need assistance? I have zero need for assistance. Perfect. I'm trying to go back and finish watching this movie. Exactly. All right. So can you please? Yeah. Please, okay, please go. Perfect. Have, have a good day. Take care. Take care. Bye. Have a good day, man. Yep, go fuck yourselves. <laughs> <laughs> and see, this is why I'm thinking it's Edomites. That's why we, you know, we read the spirit, you know what I'm saying? Because had this been Negroes, all that shit talking, he was talking. Just 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 think about a Negro doing what this guy just done. That's why I'm thinking it's a so-called white guy. So, you know, this is how you know that this is Esau Edom's kingdom. The so-called white man, that's their biblical name, is Esau. They're not white. They're actually pinkish to reddish. If you notice his arm that he kept showing when the door hit his ass, that showed that blood coming through that skin. They're red, man. You see what I'm saying? So you can tell the spirit. Just That's how you pretty much can tell somewhat of who's who. Because Jake, by the spirit, and we're, we're under those curses, Jake would have got slammed head through the gut. Jake, matter, matter of fact, Jake would have just complied. <laughs> overall because this was like an eight minute video overall about two three minutes in you know hey i mean you see some of these videos with jake they try and do this shit but it don't turn out well for him you see what i'm saying it don't that's why i'm thinking about the spirit this is esau edom and this is their kingdom and they're able to tell their cops to fuck off i pay taxes fuck off but see we pay taxes too but you ain't telling no police officers none of that shit jake be scared as shit you see when, <laughs> when police officers just driving behind him or beside him or, you know, certain areas. Jake, be, you know, this guy, he just like, hey, look, get the fuck out of my house. Hey, so it is what it is, man. Just know that this is Esau Edom's kingdom and it's falling. And, and you know why it's falling? And, and you, this is an indicator that it's falling. Because there was a time when, shit, police wouldn't even come to a so-called per white person's house. And if they did come, they would talk cordially. The, 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 the so-called white man would step out of the house onto the lawn and he'd tell them, the sergeant, hey, look, man, I, yeah, I fucked up, man. Look, dude, please let me, you know, I just want to just get some sleep. I have to go to work tomorrow, all that. No, the so-called white man is telling the so-called white man to fuck off. <laughs> so why are you, Jake, you so-called Negroes, Hispanics and Native Americans, so wanting to be these Americans. You just want to be Americans. Because see, the law worked for them. You may think, now you, you got some rights. You, they ain't just rolling up, you know, burning a damn cross in your lawn. 
You know what I'm saying? You do have some rights. It's not as bad as it was back then. But this motherfuckers, man, will put that billy club on your ass, handcuff your ass, whoop you, throw your ass in the car, and and and, and you know Jake be dying on the way to the to the to precinct, man. Jake would die in a cell, and they'll make it seem like oh he had a cardiac arrest. He was 28, fit, fit basketball player. He was lifting weights every day, but. We don't know what happened this time. He just had a cardiac arrest. Your ass would be done died in the cell. They ain't do nothing to this guy. We hear the guy upstairs talking about, oh, I just want to get back here and watch this movie. You see, he was talking, oh, yeah, I was just, shit, fuck. I was watching UFC, and here you guys go. <laughs> but, hey, this is their kingdom, man. Um, and we're, we're in the last days. On a more serious note, we're, we're living in the last days. These people are losing their kingdom, they're losing their fucking minds, and they're about to start trying to do Jake real, real dirty, man. So you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, you are the true Hebrew Israelites. And that's the reason why they don't like you, because the real, this is a Esau, Edom, and Jacob, Israel fight, man. Those are the twins that were in the womb of Rebecca. This is spiritual. Those are the twins that were in her womb that were struggling and fighting. And she was asking, if, you know, why am I thus? You know, she was asking, she had to go and acquire the Lord. Like, why am I, why the hell am I, you know, why do you, you know, why my belly keep rumbling? It's some kids and they're fighting. And, and, and to this very day, those children are still fighting. So, hey, look, wake up, man. We're living in the last days, real. This shit is about over. It's a lot of freaky shit going on. It's a lot of suspect agent shit going on amongst, um, you know, with the Hebrew Israelites. A lot of slippery stuff is slipping through and, and you have to be, you know, that's why we watch. That's why the scripture says to watch and pray. You see what I'm saying? And, you know, it's another lesson we can get into, a, a, you know, some other things. It's kind of slippery, man, right now, because these Edomites know that their end is 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 here, man. This is it. This is their last rulership. This is it. And they're going to go out fighting hard as hell. But. When you got separation like this, that's why the scriptures talks about separation, man. You know, matter of fact, I'll, I'll grab a quick scripture. Because um, I know I was just, I was really just planning on playing a video. And just letting it ride and just showing you that this is Esau Edom's kingdom and they can do it the fuck they want. <laughs> but it's but, but what they don't know is it's going to get really, really bad for them, too. They it's already bad for them. That's why he's reacting the way that he's reacting right now. You see what I'm saying? So, but when it comes down to you, Jake, and shit hit the fans, and the Lord turn these people up, it's going to be really, it's going to be a whole lot worse than that. You know what I'm saying? For our people, man. So, that's why it's so important to repent. We may be martyred. We may go through what we're going through. But if we're going to go through it, shit, you might as well go through it for the Lord's sake and, and not experience that second death. Shit, for real, man. I'm trying to get the hell out of here. Forget this place. This place is finished. You're trying to prolong this wicked ass kingdom. Matthew 12 and 25. And Yahweh Shai knew their thoughts. And Yahweh Shai is, you know, that's that's the real name of the, the son, man. That's the real name of our save, savior, man. He's not some cracker. He's not some white guy. He's not some blonde haired, blue eyed white guy. Our Lord, that shit they beat into us with that white boy. During slavery, hey, get that shit out of your mind. That's one of the main stumbling blocks that you need to kill. For real, for real. <laughs> like, for real, every time that shit pops in your mind, you need to have a a, 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 state, a stance in your mind where you like, fuck you. Get that white boy out of your mind, because our Lord is not some white guy, man. It says, and Yahweh knew their thoughts and said unto them, every kingdom divided against itself is brought to desolation. And every city or house divided against itself should not stand. See? The so-called white man don't like the so-called white man. Even if they're, especially if they're police officers. White people don't even like white people. <laughs> I see it all and I'm telling you, man. So-called white people do not like so-called white people. So you know they don't like you niggas. You so-called, you Hispanics. You Native Americans. You see how they done done you. For the past 500 years, why in the hell you think that you can blend in with them all of a sudden? It's 2022 and these people still acting uh, 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 as if it's 1800s. So what do you think is going to happen when shit hit the fans, man? Y'all better get it together because they're already divided. 
And this kingdom can't stand with them being divided. See, back in the days, 1800s, to, you know, the 1700s, good, you know, 1950s, the 40s, 60s, and all that other shit. Oh, they was perfectly perfect. Hell, they was together. White picket fence, cherry pie, and a windowsill. You know what I'm saying? They, you know, hey, look, man, all that shit is over with for them, and they know it. That's the thing. They know it. Matter of fact, <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh, well, we might as well since we in here. Let's get it. Let's um, let's see here. I want to go into the video that I was watching this morning. Where's that video at? Funny as shit, because this is how I started my day off. Who got it? Who got it? That's why I was saying I was laughing. I was laughing at this video, too. But uh, damn, is it gone? Uh, let's see if this is it. Brother Malcolm Ali. Shalom. Chicago. Call Lord, Shai, Shalom. I just want to see. Double yeah, this is the video. This is the guy right here. Check this nigga out, man. Th these to are the type of people you're about to be sword. dealing with. Check it out. You're about to be dealing with these type of people. These fucking people, man. These, 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 these Edomites done went. These motherfuckers is out their mind these days, man. I don't trust them. I work with them, and I see them, and they be looking at me like I'm crazy as hell, like, nope. I'm in and out of the building, baby. Realizing ...to screw me and everyone like me. And no one is coming to save us, and yes, I'm complaining about it. Where's the manager? I want to see the manager. I want to speak to the manager. I have a fucking complaint. <laughs> There's my Karen moment. <laughs> he said that's his Karen moment. Well, see, you got people out here like that, man. And there's millions of these, millions of these, um, these Edomites like this, man. These motherfuckers are ready to get it in. So while Jake's sitting around playing 2K, <laughs> smoking, drinking, and playing <laughs> madness. <laughs> And you better realize this crackers out here, man, that's ready to go hard. They're ready to go hard body, man. Straight up. So, hey, just be your babe. Keep your head on the swivel. Watch out. Because, <laughs> hey, we had a point of the, the country being divided. Because these people are about to be fighting each other. And if you get in the midst of it, psh, woo, you don't want a part of that, man. Lead Esau to fighting Esau. Hey, that's why with Russia and Ukraine, and, and and these damn um these these American Edomites, man, let them motherfuckers fight themselves, man. And Jake don't care anyway. A lot of Jake don't. But I've been noticing a lot of Jake to getting involved in that. They want to go over there and fight. Like, man, is you crazy? Let them, man, let them people let them fight. Shit, that's all they do. You ain't gonna shit. You, you ever seen a bar fight with Esau? Man, Esau get drunk as hell and get fucked up and get fucked up. <laughs> Straight up. So with that, I pray that the lesson was edifying. Kwame, y'all,